When the United Democratic Party was in government, the situation was not perfect. But now it seems the gang wars and murders are worse than ever in our country. And it is time for the government and people to make some serious changes before the situation becomes irredeemable. Our people have completely lost confidence in a police department that is headed by an absentee minister who is more occupied with devising plans to sell cannabis than developing common sense solutions to arresting crime. The Ministry of Home Affairs is no place for a leader who disappears in times of crisis nor refuses to seek help from the opposition and other social partners as he has done so far. It is now certainly time to put an end to the failed Karim Musa experiment. In moving forward, we need all hands on deck. It is time to appoint a national crime fighting task force with representatives from government, the opposition, social partners and community organizations in an effort to come up with medium and long-term solutions to gang violence. Immediately, the UDP recommends the appointment of a respected conflict resolution committee that will work around the clock to prevent disputes from escalating. This committee should be equipped with a confidential 24-hour hotline to respond to violence prevention tips from members of the public. Also immediately, in order to restore a sense of security to residents as we approach Easter weekend, the government should seriously consider utilizing the preventative detention mechanisms to target those who are currently terrorizing our community and robbing residents of their peace of mind and their right to live in a safe environment. Lastly, but certainly not least, the United Democratic Party recommends that the women and men in our security forces be provided with counseling services for their emotional and psychological well-being.